Why are you here? Oh, hello to you, too. The kids okay? Yeah, the kids are fine. Morgan forgot his blankie, so I thought I'd swing by and pick it up. Well, Morgan's asleep by now. I mean, I could have just sent it in the morning. You know? The rest of my evening's free. It's on my way home. I wanted to come by and get it. What's going on, I... honey? Carly, nothing is going on. If you want to go upstairs, go get the his blanket. It's in his room right now, if you want. Is this about Emily? Max! Hey, give you something? Yeah, do me a favor. Go upstairs, get uh, Morgan's blanket, and then you go ahead and drive Carly home, will you? Max, yeah. I'll get the blanket myself. Sonny and I need a minute alone. I'll be outside. I didn't come here to check up on you, and I didn't come here to butt into your personal life. I appreciate that. But when I walk in here, and I see you acting like this and slugging back whiskey, I know something's wrong. I apologize for being rude. Now, can you let it go? That's what I'm supposed to do now, huh? Because we're not married anymore. Ignore the fact that I see you in pain. Something's going on with you. And because you're fighting so hard not to tell me, I have to assume that it's Emily. This is not something we should discuss, Carly. Okay, fine. Fine. Then at least let me call Jason. Can no, I call Jason? No, no, no. Don't call Jason. <sighs> you're scaring me. No. Did you and Jason have a fight? Okay, look, I, I know this is about your feelings for Emily, and yes, it hurts. But nowhere near as much as the thought of you and Jason turning against each other. Now, what the hell happened? You're not going to let this go, right? You're not going to let this go, are you? No, uh, I'm not going to okay. let this go. <sighs> Jason walked in on uh, me and Emily at the, at the, the lodge, the skyline, whatever. Sleeping together? No. But you were close. 